Greetings people, this is Keith and Modesto doing my Let's Play Minecraft series using the Forge Mod Loader and the Direwolf 20 Mod Pack. Alright, um, so I think in the last episode I made the, ter the Terror Shatterer, right? I think I made that in the last episode. Maybe it was the episode before that. I said I needed, I think I made this thing, right? Uh, nine... Mana pulls each with a mana spark. Send, generate mana with you know the usual things I've been doing to generate mana. Send them into one pool, um, and then they get distributed to all the pools. So we got here nine full pools of mana. These pools of mana are also full uh, because they also have sparks in them. There's one. There's this spark is augmented to uh, automatically distribute the mana in its pool to other mana pools that are nearby. That the ones that sparks on top of them. Blah blah. This is all old news. Okay, so I want to try charging up the Terror Shatterer. Uh-oh. Great. I've got lots of warp. I wonder if this is going to hurt me. Well, this is an interesting effect. This is this is from Thalmcraft. I have a lot of warp. Um, there's a, actually a device in Thalmcraft to check your how much warp you have. How much of them... You can have permanent warp. You can have temporary warp. You can do things to cleanse the warp. I haven't done any of those things. <sighs> well, anyway, how long is this going to last? <clears throat> well, I want to make another augment. Let's see if I have, if I can quickly get the stuff I need to make it here. Uh, so if we get the Batania thing here, um, we want to make uh, another augment. This one is. I want to make the dominant augment. Okay, so I need fire, I guess. That's what it looked like. And I do not have a fire, so how do we need fire? Oops. Okay, so then another work gunpowder, another bricks, and mana steel. Okay, so I already have three. Oops, I have more than three in here. Okay, so we'll take one, two, three. Uh, okay, so we need, um, ugh, I don't know, I have a hard time moving sometimes. Okay, so we need some nether wart, and another brick, is that it? Oh, and gunpowder. And then we'll take these out. Oop, that's no door there anymore. Well, maybe I I could have a little bit better if I reduce my number of chunks. Then that are rendered and things will be a little smoother maybe. Maybe maybe this weird graphic uh, effect isn't helping. Might not be helping. Okay. Um, okay, I think we need this thing. So that, 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 and that. And I need my wand. Go. I need a. I need one of these. Okay. What else? I, um, then I should check. What other things do I need to make the spark? I need mana steel and pixie dust. And I have those things. Cool. Oh, it's getting more. Oh, yes, that's right. That's right. Cool. Okay, it's ready. So I just throw this on there and hit the one. Hit it with the one. And there we go. Actually, get three of them. Thunder, thunder, heard a noise. Okay, so we'll put two back. And then we just do this in the crafting table. Da, 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 da. Okay, 
now I'm going to take this, and which ones should I put it on is the question. Maybe this one? Of course, this one's was too far away. It doesn't actually it doesn't have a spark. I don't want to bother making another spark. Um, which one is not being used for something? One of these this has this has something under it. That does not. Okay. So maybe we'll do it to this one. Make that one dominant. I could always change this. Okay. The reason for doing that is I can now throw. I can now put my um, my terror shatter down and it'll soak up not just the mana that's in that pool but the mana that oh that's much better okay it'll soak up the mana from from over there too see all that mana see this little visual effects means mana is traveling from over here to this mana pool because that mana spark is now dominant, and it'll just soak up mana from all the mana pools around it. Cool. I guess it's taking it from that one first. I'm not sure about that. Okay. Uh, okay, let's do something else while that does that. And that thing, at least in the book, it says that that, um, the t that, that pickaxe, the terror shatter, will not, not despawn after five minutes, even though it's just sitting there, you know, out in the world. Okay, so, okay, another thing. Okay, so someone just suggested in, um, the comments that um, I do I should do the Gaia ritual and of course I kind of was planning on doing that so I think we should prepare prepare so ritual of Gaia you you uh, do uh, some things to prepare like namely uh, making this ritual area and uh, sacrifice a I think a terra steel ingot and and it summons a special a, mo a boss a boss mob mob boss a, a special boss for you to fight the Gaia spirit and uh, and it's supposed to be very difficult so I want to do that and we're going to do things to prepare for that fight we're not going to do that fight in this episode but one of the things to do I think is to prepare the area the area needs to be far away from the base because there's always a chance that things won't go well and that I will die and then I do not want you know if I die I will show up back at my spawn point which will be my bed here of course because that's the last place I've slept right um, if I say I set this ritual up right here right and then I, I didn't go well and I died I'd wake up right over here and uh, you know I'd be trying to uh, fend off the guy's spirit while trying to you know while I don't have any uh, weapons or armor or anything on try to repair to fight back so so the uh, the battle area it needs to be set up far away so that if I die I'm here I can take my my time to get ready to uh, go back to it and get my stuff and you know fight it okay so that's pretty normal that's a pretty normal thing to do um, and I'm thinking of course I could just fly there set up a portal or something I want to try something different and use something from uh, I mean, there's a couple different things you can do, right? So, but I want to try something from Ender IO, which is a. Um, oh, it's on here. So it's here somewhere. Uh, oh, here it is. The Ender Rail. Okay, it teleports minecarts when placed on a dimensional transceiver. Okay, so I want to make a. I want to make one. Of, um, well, I need two of them. Okay, so for that, I need a detector track. I need, and I think you need to have two of these. One for the, you know, where you start, and one for your destination, and then so you can go back. Um, so I need a detector rail. I already have already grabbed two soul vials full of Enderman. You know, you have an empty soul vial, you click on the thing, and I've done that before. So I have two soul vials ready. Um, so I, and of course I already have a soul binder. That's the block that you do this in. And I already have that. I've used it before. So I need two detector tracks, and that's made thusly. So um, I have standard rail. I have standard rail already, so I don't have to make any. The reason I already have standard rail is from looting looting chests in dungeons or excuse me at, at uh, there's a building in villages that has railcraft stuff so I already have some standard rail actually it'd be nice if I already had some wooden ties what are they called um, I know I don't remember what's it called what's it called wooden rail bed Uh, 
Or if I already had some wind ties, I probably don't. From... Oh, I do have, s I have six. Is that enough? Oh, I need two more. I don't suppose I could do those. I doubt. I doubt that. I'll do what I want. Okay, so can I make... No, it has to be a wooden rail bed. Okay, well, we can make... Um, do you get two of these with that from that one recipe? Oh, you get 16. Oh, that works then. Okay, cool. I didn't know that. Okay, so I have I happen to have already have some ties because probably from the for the same reason that I have standard rail already. So I got one of those. Now I just need um let's see here. So I need to make some pressure plates. Okay. Well, I probably only needed to make one of those. Okay, we only need two of these. Put those back. And um, I'll take out my soul vials here. One, two. Okay, and it's already dark, so let's sleep through the night. Okay. Dun, 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 dun. And the soul binder is down here. It's. Not that one. It's this one. No, it's not that one. It's this one. The one with the face. I should have known that. Okay, so we put the vial there. And we put a detector there. Oh, and I need experience. I always forget that you need experience to use the soul binder. I've got lots of experience here in the, uh, whatever this thing's called. What is this thing called? Experience obelisk. Okay, so I need, um, 20 levels. Okay. Go! I guess you could pump an experience in um, through with a pipe, I suppose. Okay, so we got one. We'll take that out. I'll put that there and this one here. Go! Alright. Oops. Okay, that's done. And we should be able to try this out pretty quickly. So I'll put that back in. Okay, so we need some track. I will just grab half a stack. That's probably, well, I'll just keep that. There's probably way more than we need. We need some levers, I think. So I guess I'll make another lever. And uh, a cart. I probably don't already have a cart. Oh, I do. I have two carts. I only need one. Um, okay, let's, let's try this out think let's let's read what the entry said again oops I actually wanted that okay oh I need transition I need dimensional transceivers hmm. okay you know I need um, I might need some other things too let's see let's see buffer Detector, booster. I'll take two boosters. Okay, that'll do for now. I'll fancy this up probably. Okay, so I need two uh, dimensional transceivers. Let's see if I have. I guess I. Ha oh, really? Is this too much for it to do? It should not be. It should not be doing anything. No, I guess. I guess two of those is just too much for my little simple system to handle. Um, yes, right here. Jeez. Okay, so let's just make one at a time. Um, I guess. Here we go. So we'll just make one. It, can, it can't handle that? Is there something missing? Oh, 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 oh. I have to make, I have to make an ender resonator and an ender crystal. I don't have those set up to be made automatically. Okay. Okay, for this, oh, I need some more, and I need an Enderman head again. So I need two Enderman head. I need two more. I need two more uh, soul valves filled with Enderman. So I guess I get to show this on camera. 
I was hoping to get this in, done enough so we could try it out before the end of the episode, but uh, now I'm thinking we might not be able to do that. This is going to take a little while. Okay, so I got the two soul valves. I just go over here to the book and go to the end. Ow, I splashed myself. Thank you. Thank you. Now oh, we gotta get away before they start attacking me. I guess I must have looked. Oh, I looked at the one I grabbed, so we're safe. Okay. Okay, now. I'm guessing this is just some silica. Oh, uh, fiber crystal. Okay, so I need to make two fiber crystals. Ah! And there they are right there. So we'll go ahead and make two. You can handle that, surely. Is that gonna take a while? It's having to make stuff. Okay, what I also need to make... Oh, um, is, um, where's it at? Dimensional transceiver, oh, it's too much stuff to look at. Okay. I guess that's so I need to make two ender resin two ender resonators. Okay. So I need Enderman heads and vibrant alloy and okay. So let's see if I have any Enderman heads in my inventory. That sure would be nice if I did. Oh, I do. I think I must have spent some time. I did. I spent a, quite a bit of time actually. So I could get ender shards. Can I spent quite a bit of time with an ender, not this one. Um Killing, you know, uh, fighting Endermen in the end, so I could get a bunch of Ender Pearls and Ender Shards. And I got Ender lots of Enderman heads. As a byproduct, okay, so, oh, maybe my vibrant crystals are done. Yes, they are. Okay, so let's go ahead and make the crystals anyway. So, guessing this goes here, and this goes here, and I need more experience okay there's one Right, so we got that done. I will just throw these in there. And uh, let's see what else was there. Okay, so this I need, oh, I need, I need vibrant ammo. I see two uh, silicon, okay. Uh, so I should just go ahead. And I'll just tell it to make 20 while we're here. Um, and I need some silicon, two of those, and uh, what was it, soul, soul ingots, I have some of those, I should, I should teach it how to make that, okay, was that it? Yeah, okay, so let's see if our alloy is done, at least. Oh, you're, it's not. Oh, I should have. I should have not done it that way. It's gonna craft all of the. It's gonna craft all of the energetic alloy it needs. Oh, that's so stupid. Uh, give me. Just give me two. Start. Um, oh, it couldn't take it back. Uh, um, let's see. There. Okay, do your thing. Uh-oh. I'm being attacked! I 
I guess I should do something about the warp I have. Ugh. This, that's a little bit scary. Okay. Um, must be done. Okay, so let's get it. Thank you. And now that'll be good enough. I'm not gonna fall. Okay. So um, it's still foggy. So I might. Does it say? It doesn't t say. Uh, I might get attacked again. Well, that'd be exciting. Okay, that's not the right, the right thing. This this is what I want. Okay, so I think it's something. We well, can only do one at a, t at a time. I think it's like this. Oh, okay. I thought I had to push a button. I should take. I should make another one of those. I should make a triple. I hope that doesn't take too long. Okay, oh, not that. This one. Okay, I won't make the other one. And I will put the I will put the capacitor in there. For future, Ooh, I don't have the other things. I didn't grab enough stuff. Oh, um. Okay, silicon on the bottom, soul sign on the top, and then it just disappears. <laughs> it's like, instead of giving you a chance to like say, ah, uh, to commit, I don't know. Oh, the capacitor's probably done. Cool. So if I have to do this again, this will be faster. And that has a double already. That has a double. Well, I guess we'll... Which one, which one of these do I use more? I use that. I'll put it in, well, I guess I'll, I guess I'll put it in this one. I'll go make, I'll go ahead and make another one. Okay, so i put those in there, put that back. And now, dimensional transceivers. Cool. Oh, and I have to wait for this thing, probably. Oh, it probably did it. It probably just did it. It probably is already done. Yes, it is. Okay. Thank you very much. Okay, so let's scratch another one. Oh, there's my timer. Oops, there's my timer. And this one's gonna take a while. It has to make more of this stuff. Because it doesn't have to make too much, though. Well, anyway. <sighs> What if this thing needs power? And it's dark. Well, let's go check out. Um, I will finish making, it'll probably finish in a moment. Um, let's just, while we wrap up this episode, I have to wrap this up, episode up, but let's go see how the Terror Shatter is doing. And we'll continue with this build in the next episode. Okay, so, and it's still, oh wait, did it drain? It drained them all, except for that has a little bit in it. So let's see what level it is. A, A, cool, okay, let's try it out. First we have to enable it, okay. And I guess we'll get on, ah. okay. How big was that? Uh, that's like one, two, three, four, five. It's a five by five. Oh, that's nice. All right, well, there you go. I'm gonna turn it off. Okay, and of course, even higher ranks are possible. As we can see here, where's my, oh, and look, when I, when I have my cursor over it, it shows, 
Oh, from A it goes to S. I think then there's an SS maybe. Um, and, and it gives an idea of how much. It's only barely into the A. Yeah, okay. So let's, let's see if our uh, other dimensional transceiver is done to poly is. And then I think we'll, we'll, we'll end this episode. Let's see. Yes, it finished. All right. So in the next episode, I'm going to, what I'm going to do in the next episode is like just set this up, I guess, outside um, to test it out. Like, you know, one, one of these rails, what are they called? Ender rails. One ender rail over here and the other ender rail over here. And I'll, you know, just set it up so we can know how, so we know for sure how it works before I go flying off somewhere. Okay, so this has been Katie Medessa playing a lot of Minecraft. Thank you for watching. I hope you have a fantastic day.